All right, day 82 and we've left Diamond Head, Mississippi, and we're in New Orleans right now, the French Quarter, and we're just gonna go around, we're gonna visit for a little while, then we're gonna get our hotel room this afternoon, so I wanna say bye to you right now and see what we can find here in the French Quarter and see what happens. Now we're coming up on Craig Tracy's gallery, but uh, as I learned, he's going to be out of town until April 4th doing a body painting uh, competition. So I'm at least going to get a little video of his studio if I can, if it's open. If it's not, I'll have to come back. Oh, there we go. It is open. Yay! And uh, as you see, Eight twenty seven Royal Street, Craig Tracy, Fine Art Body Painting Gallery. It used to be painted alive. Now it's a uh, Craig Tracy's gallery. But uh I'll see if I can get video inside. If not, we'll see what happens later.
All right, so I got permission from Craig Tracy's brother who's watching the gallery for him and running it for him pretty much so Craig could do what he wants to do. And um, I hope you liked it. I mean, there's a lot of great new paintings in there. And uh, I hope you enjoyed the little walking tour I did inside. And uh, let's see what else we can find out here in New Orleans. You never know what you're going to see. So let's see. As you notice, even in the middle of the street in New Orleans, they've got stuff going on. And this is off of Royal Street. So, I mean, you never know what you're going to see here. People standing outside stores. People playing a cello in the middle of the street. Cell phone ringing as I got a message from European Body Yard off of Facebook. Uh, just different things going on. Uh, we actually got to head back to the car to get shoes for Savannah because her feet are aching and she was wearing flip-flops to walk around New Orleans with. So I want to get some more stuff. We're definitely going to come back down uh, towards Jackson Square and get some video of that and some of the different performers that are down there. And like I said, you never know what's going to go on. We'll see what comes next. All right, we're coming up to Jackson Square, and this is where the cathedral's at. I'll see if I can get a video of the cathedral too while I'm at it, but just want to show you a little bit about what's going on down here. You got vendors galore. Yeah, nothing down this way much, but usually in the front by the cathedral, you'll get a lot. I'll see if I can get you a video of the inside. We'll see in a second.
Well, that was the inside of the cathedral. What'd you think? Pretty neat, huh? Yeah. And let's see, what else do we have out here? We got some more tarot readers. And we got some musicians, artists. Big musician right here. Another tarot reader over across the way. Lots of stuff to do. But, uh, as I said before, let's see what else we got going on here. So now we're heading over to Cafe Du Mans to get some beignets and some coffee. And, uh, oh, we're having lunch first, and then we're going to go to Cafe Du Mans and get beignets and coffee. So I was corrected. I'm going to just walk down here a little bit and show you some more of the vendors that are down on this side. Because these guys are really good. I mean, some of the work is out there, but some of it's really great. And you'll appreciate it as being an artist that watch my videos. So let's take a look at some of them. Hi. No pictures. Oh, no pictures? Sorry. And there is Café Du Monde, the original Café Du Monde, where you can get the best beignets in the world and the best coffee. Maybe I'll get a box that I can take home so we can make beignets at home. We'll just have to see. So after we eat, I'll show you a little bit more of Café Du Monde. Okay, so just got done eating at Frank's, and if you want a world famous muffalata, this is the place to go. That sucker was good, and so was their. Uh... Okay, so I'm in front of Cafe Du Monde, and you can hear the band playing. We just ate, and we're a little bit too full to have cafe and beignets, but as you can see, it's a full place, and it never does get any slower than that. It's always full, all the time. So, we're going to head on down and uh, probably back to the car and back to the hotel room not sure we'll see what else I might have but uh hey we're having fun here in New Orleans and uh, a lot of great artists a lot of great horses and talk to you later okay so we're in the hotel room and we just finally got in uh, we're staying at um, What's the name? Economy Inn. It's a newly renovated hotel in uh, Thibodeau, and, or Thibodeau, Louisiana, which is just about 30 minutes outside of Oak Alley Plantation, so it's a perfect spot. We got it for the next four days, so we're going to be held up here for a little while. Um, may change rooms depending on how noisy it gets next door with some of these buttheads, but uh, I think my partner's home. So I'm going to end this video, and I hope you enjoyed all the rest of the little snippets that I had. Yesterday's video up here, tomorrow's video over here. Rate, comment, subscribe. Love you guys, and thanks for watching. Bye.